Hey guys, I wanted to share something really exciting with you today, and that is a haul from the body shop. Um, I a couple weeks ago, actually, it was probably about a month ago. I signed up for Groupon, and um. I kind of just got annoyed with their emails, but one day it's a, I had one that's at the body shop. And so I clicked on it, and the deal was you paid 12 euros for 30 euros worth of um, merchandise. And I was like, wow, that's a really good deal. It ends up coming out to like 60%, I think. Um, and so you could buy up to five, which means you got. 150 euros worth of products for 60 euros, which means you almost get 100 euros worth of free products. So I jumped on it and I got my five and then I totally forgot. And then about two days ago, I realized that it was going to expire soon. And sorry, there's one of my neighbors is like throwing things out of his window. Anyways. So I realized it was going to expire soon, so I knew I had to get in store, and I was really afraid that I was going to get there, and they were going to tell me I could only use one at a time. But I talked to the woman, and she essentially said that I should get as close to I could to 150 euros, and then she would split it up, and then whatever the difference was, I would pay it. So that's what we did, and I'm going to... I got... I've never tried the brand before, so I really wanted to get kind of a wide variety of products. I got makeup, which is what I had heard so much about. I got a body butter, which they're also really well known for. I got some skincare and some hair care. So I kind of really wanted to give the brand as a whole kind of a like once over. And obviously this is a haul, so I'm just gonna show you what I got. And then um, once I get a chance to try out everything, I will update and put a review up. Although you will be able, after I post this video, I will post the tutorial for this look, which is using all of the products that I, well not all of them, but products that I bought from the body shop. So we'll just get started. I also have prices for everybody in case you're interested. I kept all of my receipts. There's five of them. Um, so I guess I will just start with the body butters and I couldn't decide between a scent and I stood there for like 15 minutes smelling all of the body butters if you don't know about the body shop they are um, like eco-friendly they um, use recycled materials they um, they're just very earth conscious I guess but I couldn't they have they're best known for their body butters and I think they have like 15 different like scents. And so I was sitting there smelling and I couldn't decide. And then I noticed that they had these little sets which come in this really cute metal tin that looked like this. You can tell this was 15 euros. Um, and it comes with three smaller sized body butters which I thought was really great for me because I travel a lot. Um, I can, they're small enough that I could throw them in my big purse if I absolutely needed to. Um, and so the three, um, the three flavor or scents that I got are, um, Moringa, I don't know how you say this, but this was the scent that I, I was almost sure that I was going to purchase if I was just going to purchase one of the big ones. The big ones I think are 15 euros. So so I got three smaller ones for the price of one bigger one and it looks like this. And this one reminds me of like lilies I want to say. Like there's a kind of lily that it reminds me of. Um, and it also, it also has kind of a honeysuckle smell to it. I don't know. But anyways, I really like this. I haven't tried this one. This one specifies... Oh, no, that's not this one. But it just says... Yeah, it says for normal to dry skin. 
Um, and it says with Moringa seed oil to moisturize. So there's that one. And then there is the strawberry body butter, which as you can guess smells like strawberry. And this really does. It smells like strawberry ice cream. Like, or like smuckers, you know, those smack, lip smackers or whatever they were called. Um, it smells like the strawberry one of that. And then this one says for normal skin. So I guess they have like specific, they have targeted skin types. Um, so this one is again the, sorry, I'll put it in English, the strawberry body butter. And then the last one is the sweet lemon body butter. Sorry, I, I opened the makeup before I did this, um, obviously, but I didn't open any of this stuff, so. Um, this one, and this actually doesn't smell too, like, lemon chili, which is kind of what I'm afraid of most of the time. Um, it smells really fresh, almost like lemon dish detergent. I don't know how to explain. I'm really bad with scents. But um, out of the two, I would say that I, I love the, the Moringa or whatever this one is. Um, I think this one's my favorite scent, and then the Sweet Lemon. And the tin is actually really cute. It's really thick metal, and so I'll definitely be able to use that. Um, I'll probably end up like putting lipsticks or something like that in there. So there's that, and again, that was 15 euros. God, I'm going to have to hurry through this because this is going to get long. Um, okay, and then I wanted to try some of their skincare, but I couldn't decide on just one item. And so I was really looking at the tea tree, um, the tea tree collection. All of their, their skincare is split up into like, to like concerns. There's, um, vitamin C, which is for like glowing, vitamin E, which is like deep moisture. They have ones for mature skin. Anyways. I've been having um, some breakouts recently, and so I wanted to try the tea tree oil in specific, but I also wanted to kind of give their skincare line a try. So I got the, I wish that this didn't sell, tea tree skin essentials. And um, for, for imperfections, and it was also 15 euros. And it comes in a little bag like this. Um, and inside, it has a tea tree skin clearing facial wash, which looks like this. It has a tea tree skin, sorry, toner, which is really what um, I, besides the pure tea tree oil, I really wanted to try the toner also. Then I have tea tree skin clearing lotion, and last but not least, the tea tree oil. And I looked, and this is the the tea tree oil that comes in this thing is the same size as the tea, the regular tea tree oil that they sell. And the regular tea tree oil is eight euros. So I was planning on buying that, and then I realized that this was the same size as the one in on the shelf. Um, so for essentially seven more dollars, I got a cleanser, a toner, and a lotion. So obviously I will be giving that a go for the next week or two and letting you guys know what I think about that. And I'm not even gonna worry about that right now. And then, um, yeah, I'll just go through, okay. So I also wanted to try some of their hair care products because the water here is really not good. <laughs> um, I mean, I don't drink it. I don't, I don't know. It also dries my hair out really bad. And I mean, I have dry hair to begin with. I don't color my hair. Um, this is my natural hair color. I mean, there's, I used to color my hair though. So, I mean, it's still a little bit damaged. Um, but I saw their Rainforest Moisture collection, which says for dry hair with Percaxi per, per oil, Manchetti nut oil, and community trade honey. 
Um, and this has a um, shampoo, conditioner, and then a um, moisture mask, which is what I was um, most excited about. And again, like I said, I bought smaller sizes of things so that I could try out a wider variety of their products um, and then decide if I wanted to purchase full sizes of anything. So inside it comes with a green comb that says the body shop, which is nice. I like these these wide tooth combs for combing through my hair after um, I take a shower. And then, um, so this is the Rainforest Moisture Hair Butter for dry hair. And it's like a deep moisture uh, conditioner type thing. It kind of smells like Play-Doh. But, I mean, if it if it's nice for my hair, then I don't really care that much because I put things in my hair after I get out of the shower that make it smell nice anyways. And then, this is just the... The conditioner and the shampoo. So I'm going to try these out also over the next week. So I'll probably post an, a video um, that's kind of an overall body shop skincare, hair care video. And then I have two more things that are skincare related and then I'll probably make another video that's just the makeup. Um, so this will be part one. Um, and then I got, I was looking at their vitamin E line which is for like moisture, hydration. They also, one of the only things that I didn't get that I wish I had was they had um, two like face sprays. They had a, one in the vitamin C collection that was energizing, one in the vitamin E collection that was hydrating. I think they were eight euros a piece, so I will definitely be getting one of those, I know for sure. Um, okay, so this is the vitamin E illuminating moisture cream. And I like the packaging. It's pink. The cream itself is pink. And when I saw the words illuminating, I was like, ooh, because I also, it was next to the, the daytime moisturizer and the nighttime moisturizer. So I figured it had to have something different. And it does. And I really don't think that you're going to be able to see this on camera. There's what it looks like. It looks kind of gross in the jar. I used it underneath for, as my moisturizer for today. But and I really don't think... If I swatch this, you're going to be able to see either. Oh, you can kind of see. It's got this really, really nice luminous to it. It reminds me of a more subdued version of Matt's Max Strobe Cream, which I loved for a long time, but it breaks me out. So I used this... Um, obviously, I don't know if this is going to break me out. I'm hoping it's not. Um, the one thing I can say is it sinks into the skin really fast, which I love. Because I hate having to wait around for like 20, 30, 45 minutes for a moisturizer to sink in before I can put my makeup on. So, I want my phone. So, this is a really good one. Well, I mean, I think. First impression, this is a really good one. And it just smells kind of fresh. I mean, I don't kind of like a cream. And then the last thing was my gift with purchase. And it's another one of the um, body butters. And it's the same size as the ones in my trio. And it is the coconut one. And this one smells like coconut. Although this one seems to be a lot like thicker than the other two. But it doesn't, it doesn't smell like sweet, sweet cocoa. I mean, I don't really like coconut, but I like the smell of this. So that is all for the skincare side of the Body Shop products. And so I will, um, right after this one, I will upload a makeup one because I have quite a few makeup uh, products too. So I will see you guys for part two. Bye.